Hey guys, I hope everyone's doing well. In this video, I'm going to talk about the PlayStation Gold Wireless Headset. Now, it says that it's new on the box, but it's been out for a little bit of time, and I recently wanted to pick up a affordable, I repeat that, affordable pair of wireless headset. And I know that PlayStation uh, sometimes gets a bad rap with their own headsets versus the two to three hundred dollar um, you know headsets that are out there in the market but I wanted to see if these were worth the price tag um, and give you my honest review on it. I've been using them now for I would say about two weeks so I think I can go over all the features uh, the, the pluses and minuses to this wireless headset. So I'm going to crack this box open and I'll show you what's inside it. So inside the box you get the headset now this one is the white version, there is a black version. You get the transmitter that you have to plug into the USB-A port to your PlayStation or 4 or Pro, whatever version you have. And of course they do give you a USB-A to micro USB cord to charge it. And there is also a 3.5 millimeter jack just in case you want to plug that in directly to a device uh, just in case the battery dies um, on the headset. So after two weeks of trying this out, using it online, I would say for the money, now mind you, as of this video, there was a great deal on Amazon. I think they were $79 um, versus I think like 115 or a little bit over 100. So for 80 bucks, I have to say these are good quality, but not the best. And I'm sure plenty of people will have uh, good comments down below. Um, there were plenty of times when playing when the sound quality comes in and out. Uh, I don't know if it's just the game, the connection, but uh, I do have really, really good Wi-Fi in my house. So very shocking that the... PlayStation headphones were having issues, especially when it comes to sound. Now, what's really cool about these pair of headphones, now, there is an app, you can update the software, everything um, along with that, but there are settings. So you can actually um, go to the headphone app once you download it, and then you can, if you have certain games, you can put it into one of two presets. Uh, basically, what all that does is the sound quality gets a little bit more amplified, uh, more definition uh, in the surround sound kind of concept. But overall, you know, it wasn't that much of a difference. Um, I have to say, though, if you are, you know, just trying to, I don't want to say take the cheap route, but I know that there are really expensive headphones uh, wireless headsets out there for for online gaming and you don't want to spend two three hundred dollars and you're just a casual gamer I would say these are probably your best bet to pick up and you know in the, in the scheme of things if you're only using it maybe two three times a week maybe just on the weekend I think these are a perfect headset um, I do have to say though if you're talking to people um, the, the sound clarity, everything's good. Like I said, there are times where I was having issues where the sound was coming in and out. Um, basically it sounded like it was skipping almost if you can imagine listening to a, an album and then all of a sudden just, you don't hear anything for about two seconds, three seconds, just dead ear. And then everything comes back into, um, you know, the sound comes back. So uh, other than that, it's pretty much straightforward. It's a nice leather, leatherish kind of feel, kind of plush. I will say that, you know, after an hour, if you're really heavy into gaming, they do start to hurt. They are adjustable. These swing up both sides. Uh, volume, everything you can control on the left side of the ear cup. Um, but other than that, you know, it goes over the air, which I like, uh, you know, it doesn't sit on the air. It, it goes over the air. So you're getting that full, 
uh, surround sound, you know, S quality. But like I said, for the price, I think still on Amazon as of this video is about $79. Uh, like I said, if you are a casual gamer, someone that doesn't want to spend two, three hundred dollars on a wireless headset, I think these are the best route to take. And also knowing that, you know, if you do buy it and you don't like it, you can always return it depending on what site you get it from. But I think that most people would be pretty happy. Now, I will say there are different levels to PlayStation headphones. And this one technically is the second from the highest. But, you know, like I said, in the whole scheme of just enjoying weekend gaming, maybe an hour or two uh, throughout a week, you know, uh, if, if you're really into heavy gaming, stay away from these completely. I, I know a bunch of people will probably leave comments, uh, all the great headphones that are, that are out there, but I will say that uh, if you know your headphones, you're probably laughing at this video, but at the same time, there are people that don't want to spend two, three hundred dollars. And, you know, PlayStation provides a pair of headphones that I think caters to a certain um, gamer, so to speak. But other than that, I have to say, give them a shot. Like these are the white version. They do make a black version as well. And if you have any questions or if you guys want me to test out any other headphones or any other gaming or tech, just leave a comment and please subscribe to the channel because that definitely helps. And uh, in having you guys that are already supporting the channel, I appreciate that. So until the next video, cheers.